The Osamis Police has begun the excavation earlier on the alleged mass grave of victims of the Parohinog family in Purukwan, Barangay Cogon, Osamis City. Barangay Chairman Leonardo Makairan of Barangay Cogon says several residents reported to her the foul smell coming from the said area. Hindi ko alam kung mayroon bang itinapon dyan na tao. Ang ako lang narinig sa mga residente dito na mayroong mabaho sa hangin. Hindi nila makita na mayroong tinapo na tao. Because of this, Makairan ordered the filling of the well with soil. Police Chief Inspector Jovi Espinido says the Parohinogs used to dump the remains of the victims in the said well. So yun talaga ang lagyan niya pagka yung biktima ng rabiri or madali nila dito na walang mga hindi taga rito, magdududa sila na asit ng gobyerno, mga intelligence, so doon na. Oh, doon dito na ilagay. Yung mga mga biktima nila, dadalhin dito, dudahan nila kung sino ka, hindi ka, ma, hindi ka hindi malaman kung saan yung address mo, dalhin ka dito. Pati yung tao nila, basta dudahan nila, dito na. After excavating the well and another suspected mass grave using a backhoe, authorities found no human remains. They have yet to determine if the remains were placed on a sack or there is a need to examine the excavated soil. Residents of the said area say the well is 60 feet deep. Espinido adds that aside from Barangay Cogon, there is another area that served as Parohinog's mass grave. Meanwhile, the Department of Justice already filed multiple charges against the Parohinog siblings Nova Princess and Reynaldo. The DOJ sees probable cause to file them with illegal possession of firearms and ammunition and possession of dangerous drugs charges. Reynaldo will also face illegal possession of explosives charges after bombs were found in his house during a raid. The DOJ says the siblings are not allowed to own any kind of firearms, but high-caliber firearms were still found in their possession. Shabu were also found at their house during the police raid. Victor Cosare, UNTV News and Rescue, Philippines.